There was a new technology in the 18th, late 18th century of, of tooth transplants, if you can believe it or not. Uh, it was pioneered in France and England in which a dentist uh, would, they would be hired by um, you know, a well-to-do client uh, and uh, who ha had a tooth they wanted replaced. Uh, and what they would do is transplant a healthy tooth from a donor into the place left by the extracted a diseased tooth. Now, who would volunteer? Well, plenty of people would volunteer if you paid them enough. Mm. And, um, and so this was, you know, the new technology and people throughout the country, dentists were offering it. And we know that uh, in the year after Washington returned uh, from the revolution, he, a, you know, a French dentist who he had known during the revolution came to Mount Vernon, who was practicing this um, uh, this this technique, and we also know and this has just been revealed recently. Uh, uh, Mary Thompson, a researcher at Mount Vernon, discovered a document in which it refers to Washington paying uh, a, a group of of of, of African Americans, presumably his slaves, for their teeth. Mm. And which mean you know the scenario is kind of terrifying to contemplate where. Um, the dentist would extract a healthy tooth and insert it into Washington's jaws 